Hi, John Mark here, and we're gonna talk about sweet picking. Um, so basically, um, uh, a few years back, I was lucky enough I got to meet uh, Bubblefoot, or Ron Thal, and uh, I asked him. I said, I, I don't know how to sweet pick at all. Um, you know, how do you teach yourself how to sweet pick? And and he and he suggested this exercise to me. I'm not name dropping, just giving credit where credit is due. Um, so basically, you go to the bottom two strings, the B and the E, and you mute them, and you just pick, starting on the B, you go down, down, up, down, down, up, down, down, up. Um, but you do it in like a, kind of a, a galloping kind of da 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 kind of pattern. Uh, and you just do that till you're consistent, and, and eventually um, you'll get the sweep picking. Because, uh, you know, the hardest part of, of sweep picking, if, assuming you're going, you know, uh, low to high and then back down um, is turning around at the bottom so um, you know that, that kind of um, ingrains it into your muscle memory it, you know you, you gotta kinda um, just repeat these things till they're totally mindless you know you, you, your hands just it feels like they're automatically doing it's muscle memory but uh, alright so, so let me demonstrate that for you so it's just uh, So uh, that's the idea with that. Um, another nice thing about doing those uh, that that kind of pattern is you can do little uh, two-string uh, sweeping things um, between the B and the E. Like uh, for instance, uh, we could do like a B minor triad here, where we go seventh fret B string, seventh fret E string, and then uh, tenth fret E string with your, with your pinky. So the first two with the index, last one with the pinky, and then uh, so. So the picking goes down, down, up, pull off. So uh, down, down, up, pull off. Uh, so it, it should sound something like this. Uh, except the last part. Um, but you get the idea, and, and you know you can do them with with uh, you know that was minor, but you could do like major. Uh, you get the idea. But um, so yeah, basically, if you, if you really practice that down down up thing, and then start throwing in some triads. That, you know, then it's easy enough to just, you know, take a bar chord and just, uh, just kind of throw in the, the, like the other stuff, it is the easier part of the sweep. It's that bottom part. So if you get that bottom part in green, then, then you know, you can throw in the, the bottom stuff a lot easier.